today with the part three of creating functionality to quickly play pause. The first we need to write the amount total of the order will be is the sum of all prices total added to the card. We will use amount total and with this value will be added to the state of the application to, to add uh, reactivity. And now we need to add the amount total behind of the component the list card and the amount total when we click the item the amount total is updated. Now let's continue. In the car component we need to add the quantity. The, the quantity uh, uh, because we need to to uh, to car will be uh, we show the the quantity and the amount amount total of the of the order I say a name a quantity using uh, underline to the to the name let's go to see how it will look. We will change this underline by italic using a component HTML component. And let's go to show how it's looking. More, much better. Now the next is to add the image to the product. We need to to get this uh, this field and load it this uh, field in the template using this uh, code to codify the image. It's working, everything okay. Now it's time to notify when the product is added to the or to the car using a use service notification. We we use we will show a user notification with the name of the product added now using notification product added to the card we go to show the, the product uh, product name we need to to notify the user what product was uh, added to the order product added to the order everything okay this notification are using a use service notification. Let's go to add a uh, buttons to add or remove product to the from the from the card list. This this code is in the product component and using product we notify to the parent company about the product uh, click it using button button actions using t on click add to cart is the same function that we have to, uh, until now And minus the product we remove from the from the car. Now creating a class uh, to show the buttons 
in the, in the component HTML and display flag because the, for the buttons to use uh, we need to to display the the the, 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 the buttons margin and um, let's go how it's working yeah very ugly but now using Postgres we will be changed the buttons Mm, let's go vamos um, maybe the link button adding in the class button link how it to look let's go to check these properties we need to move to the product component because we are using component mm, it's working both button are are you doing the same function add to car later we will show how to remove from the car now for the component success to test how how's look green mm, maybe maybe primary because we need to use blue sorry but this is uh, very important is the the way that the blue don't uh, are show let's go check it's much better and the notification is showed because we are clicking in the button now we need to add remote from car this function we need to pass this function in the products from the product component to the parent component Notifi notifying about the product click it this is a function in the props and in the main company we need to implement the remote card that receives as a product ID product ID in the shop we need to, to find the product in the shopping cart if the product exists we need to rest one and if the product don't exist we, we will show a notification let's go now is the product exist um, um, let's go copy here because it's the same code just just uh, just change the sync using minus if the product exists we need to date the quantity if the product is graded or one and exit yes because uh, there are many states here if the product exists and the quantity is graded that one we need to press one in the quantity but if the product exists and the quantity is not one is the product we need to to notify about the the product don't exist in the shopping cart this is the shopping cart finding this product if the quantity is graded it's that one yeah using codium you codium ii is 
very useful to to complete the code else a shopping cart we need to remove if the product the quantity is one and click in the remove product the product we will remove from the cart let's go to check how this working in the base company we need to use the, the same function using bind to notify the parent company and the child company product not found bro because the product is not in the line in the list um it's a product ad sorry um product in the car sorry is um product in the product car sorry it's the mistake and um, add 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 minus 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 everything's okay thank you